Oh, yeah. Good morning. Hey, how are you doing? Good. Here. <laughs> You know what the Bible says about calling uh, the police on brother? Yeah. Well, just so you know, I, I'm so, I am. I don't again. Yeah. The police need to tell you this, or yeah. Well, just so you know, I am being sarc sarcastic when I say I love your spirit, sir. So, you'd rather just call the police on us than actually... <laughs> okay, go ahead. Just so you know, so you're being a liar right now. Nobody's blocking anybody. So you're actually lying to the magistrates. You should repent of lying, sir. Repent of your apathy, sir. Repent of your apathy, sir. making yourself out to be the victim. You're making yourself out to be the victim here. Imagine the people. Repent of lying. You sit there right before God on the steps of your own 501c3 church and lie to the magistrates. It's wicked, sir. It's wicked. You should repent. How can you lie like that? Number one cause of death is child sacrifice in the land. And the church is all but silent about it. it ignores child sacrifice. You have a good moral opinion, but you are a wicked man for ignoring child sacrifice and not doing anything to help stop it. It's wicked. And then you lie to get rid of us when we try to expose the injustice. You shouldn't be security. You know what you should be? You shouldn't be security. You shouldn't, man. You're a liar. Why would they hire a guy who's a liar as their security agent? Abortion is the number one cause of death in the land. And though your pastor and your church has a fine moral position, a moral opinion, they do nothing to help make it illegal in the land. And what we're doing is we're asking people to make it illegal in the land, not just be pro-life. Can I give you one, sir? Thank you. God bless you guys. Have a good service. Number one cause of death in the land is child sacrifice. And though this church has a fine moral opinion, it does nothing to help make it illegal in the land. And sir, this, off, this guy right here is a liar. We didn't block anybody from going in and out of the church. Uh, this man's a liar. Yeah, he said we were blocking people from going in and out of the church. He's a liar. 